Hal Dane going for another sectional title and yet another piece of hardware for the already overcrowded trophy case. The Blue Devils went up a quick 1-0 before we could even get our cameras out of the bag. Marina Martin scored in the first minute of the game and Hal Dane had plenty of chances to do it again. Hal Dane in white, Martin offers, Hopfelder blocks it, Allison Chiera is there with the rebound and Solomon Schechter dodges a bullet. Meanwhile, Schechter didn't threaten much, but when they did, Sarah Labriola was right there. Going the other way, Hannah Monteleone feeds Martin, who places it to the far post, but Alzi Cinquenta and Julia Rotondo just couldn't get there in time. The score remained 1-0 until this. Marina loads and fires it past Lily Hotchfelder. That made it 2-0. And watch the footwork of number two, Bailey McCullough. She eludes one defender, then splits both defenders and splits the posts. It's 3-0 Haldane. Martin picked up another just before the half ended. The Blue Devils led 4-0 at halftime. Second half, and a scary moment as Martin sends the ball towards the far post. Here comes McCollum, and watch what happens to Hotchfelder as she tries to defend. She bangs the post, but would show her toughness and get right back at it. So would Haldane, though. As Martin gets her fourth goal of the game, it was 6-0 before Schechter scored two late goals in the game, and Haldane repeats his Section 1 champs with a 6-2 win. Well, this is just a, a group of girls. They're different characters every year, and they know how to win. We uh, had two really good girls graduate last year, and Allie and Sarah, and the younger ones are, that's why we brought up the JV. They're learning from a very great, a very good team. These guys, are they play well together. Uh, they're not a travel team. Uh, we have a couple of stars on a team. Bailey McCollum, Missy Lissacados, Marina Martin played great today. Hannah Monteleone was a little under the weather and she still gave the effort of a champion. What did you see on the field that made it so easy for you? Um, you know, they were really playing sort of flat back, so it was easy to, the through ball was on today and our midfielders were able to, like Bailey was definitely able to capitalize on that. Um, we connected a lot of times through that, um, playing each other off the cross and off of the, um, on the long ball through. So I really think we were able to adjust well to their playing style, and that really helped us out. It was a great like overall team game. I thought everyone played well. Yeah. What What do you think is uh, the characteristic or the strength of this year's team? Um, we're very competitive, I think, and we like don't let anything get in our way. Yeah. Well, this year we have to rely on each other more. We don't have like the speed up top as much, so we have to control the back line, control passing, and work with each other. Send those through balls, find the feet. It's a little different than last year. When you guys score the first goal in the first minute, that first goal is always important, but to score it so quickly like you guys did and then just come back with another one and another one, at that point you're probably starting to feel a little relaxed? Um, yeah, but we knew that we had to stay on our toes because like they scored the two goals. We had to make sure that they weren't coming back because they weren't going away. Tell me what is in the water at Haldane because what, what you guys just keep winning <laughs> in every sport. It's just like volleyball, basketball, soccer. It's amazing, and you're yeah. such a small school. Yeah, I know. We have a lot of heart and determination. You know, we all play different sports. Like, I played three sports, so we know what it feels like to win, and everyone wants to be back there at it. You know, I really think it's just a part of the community, and sports has become a huge part of the culture, and it's always been that way. And coming into high school here, it was really just throw you right in, you're just in a culture of success and a culture of working hard. So it's, it's really good to be put in a program like that. And it just sets you up for success. <laughs>